the longest race of the weekend and the final race of the weekend. It is the Queen Alexandra, two miles and five and a half furlongs, the complete distance around this Ascot track. In this listed event, five horses here. The favorite is Magical Retreat, as well as our top rate horse, the rating of 117. The rest are below 83. Field of fives in line, and away they go. And Kings Carosa missed the start in his debut. So we do see the two debut runners, Kings Carosa and Polar Twisted, near the back of the pack. The favorite, uh, carrying a lot of weight, is Magic. Uh, uh, sorry, the favorite. Rated very highly here is Magic Retreat going well to the back, and it's going to be out early Warrior 1. So Warrior 1 is going to lead them across the straightaway as the rain starts to f continues to fall here at Ascot. It's Warrior 1 up by about 7 or 8 lengths over Zoe Hippopotamus. Then the maiden, then the first time star of Kings Carosa is next. Um, behind them, tucked on the rail, is Magic Retreat in the light blue. And on the outside, the other first time starter, Polar Twisted. So it's Warrior 1 leading them here in Warrior 1, the quick leader of Warrior 1 for Serious Chill. Ran 11th last time in the Welsh Gold Cup, uh, was a winner earlier at, early out this season, and the case closed Stayers Handicap. So trying to go for another Stayers win here. Been staying around 21 furlongs, and it seems to be a good distance for Warrior 1. Next up is the first time starter, Polar Twisted for Derek Hinton. Uh, Derek Hinton just came out of a win last time out. We'll see if he can win uh, in last race, and we'll see if he can win two races back-to-back -back here with this first-time starter as we head inside 15 furlongs. Next up, then, is Zoe Hippopotamus. Zoe Hippopotamus is running for Graham Clutterbuck. Ran earlier this year in a Group 1 event. The Sydney Cup handicap uh, was a well-beaten 11th there. Last time out coming out of that joint race, the Welsh Gold Cup illicit event. And the low, and the pretty much the prep here, the prep for this race, um, was fifth earlier on this year in the virtual racing everyday maiden stakes and fourth in the woodlands maiden stakes. Of course, our favorite is Magical Retreat. Now Magical Retreat sitting third, uh, was second in the Welsh Gold Cup, a winner in the Drew Watts 759 maiden stakes in the debut, third race of the year for this one, uh, for John Morgan. And then our trailer is King Carosa for Darren Howells. King Carosa making first start on the season. So we head inside 11 furlongs to go. It's still Warrior 1 leading up by a couple lengths over Magical Retreat. Polar Twisted is behind them. A good 7 or 8 lengths ahead of Zoe Hippopotamus. And then King's Carosa is our trailer. So it's Warrior 1 up by about a length or two over Magical Retreat, who's running very well. And then behind them is Polar Twisted as they head inside the undulating track on the inside. It's nine and a half furlongs to go. So Warrior 1 is leading up by two in the yellow silks. Behind them is Polar Retreat in the light blue and the black cap. Then the pink and green. It's Polar Twisted. A good six lengths back to, in, to King's Cross in the orange and black. And then in... The white, red, and green stripes is Zoe Hippopotamus. The old miles all that's left to run, so it's Warrior 1 here. Warrior 1 is leading up by a half a length now as Magical Retreat, the heavy favorite and a high-rated horse, tries to get there. Then Polar Twisted up uh, in third, a good five or six lengths back to King Carosa. And then Zoe Hippopotamus is our trailer as Magical Retreat now draws even and just pokes in front of Warrior 1 inside six furlongs to run. So it's Magical Retreat up by a half a length over Warrior 1, then Polar Twisted. Many lengths back to King's Carosa and Zoe Hippopotamus is our trailer in, with five furlongs to go. So Magical Retreat's up. Warrior 1's behind them, Polar Twist is next, Bunches left to Kings Carosa and Zoe Hippopotamus. The field of 5 is strung out about probably 10 or 12 furlongs between, uh, 10 or 12 lengths covers the whole field. Now Zoe Hippopotamus quickens from the back of the pack as does King Carosa as they head down the straightaway. It's Warrior 1 leading by a neck over Magical Retreat, Polar Twist is behind them. Couple lengths back to Zoe Hippopotamus sends King Carosa as the trailer. Inside three furlongs to go, Magical Retreat now starting to open up now on this field. It's Magical Retreat waving the wand and going on by. Magical Retreat with two furlongs to go is opened up by about five or six. Polar Twist is now trying to get to Magical Retreat, but Magical Retreat 
put on the cap and is running away with it. Can Polar Twister get to him? A furlong to go. It's still Magical Retreat all out. Waving the wand behind. Trying to put a spell on this field. And Magical Retreat does just that. Pulls away by even more in clear 6-7 length winner to end Royal Alaska. The Queen, Ale uh, Queen Alexandra Stakes goes to a Magical Retreat. Polar Twister was a very good second in first career start for Derek Hinton. But it's Magical Retreat finished first. Polar Twister second. Zoe Hippopotamus third. Warrior one fourth and King's Corosa finished fifth.